We're moving in after Greece. I think this is a good plan. We might as well stay at war because we've got to start catching up. We've got to start gathering up more cities or else uh, we, we're going to lose. So we should begin our first Greek siege uh, within this video, probably in about two turns because his encampment is going to be done. So that'll be great. Um, now, in this city, we need a lot more builders. Builders and... Oh, that's going to take way too long. Hold on. We'll, we'll, we'll do it someplace else then. Let's do a water mill there. And, uh, and we need to fix our economy with more traders. That will also be pretty important. Um, now, let's see what we can do here. Uh, wait a second. Oh, I still have to go one more turn, I think. Yeah, I've got to go next turn. Do we want to stay or do I want to... Uh, let's just stay right there. That's fine. Stay stay right there. And now we'll we'll kind of go to the next turn. Yeah, let's do that. I don't care about Argos. I'll keep them alive. I'll keep Greece alive if we need to. That's totally no problem. Um, Lublin's now doing a lot better. These cities need to continue to, you know, get back on track. I think their housing was, was lacking, so we'll kind of fix that. Uh-oh. Okay, so now you're thinking about something. Nah, that's not a good enough deal, though. Yeah, don't throw your hands in the air like you just don't care. Uh, I'll, maybe if he's willing to peace out with me. So, Frederick gave me an amazing deal. I didn't even have to take this city myself. We probably still would have been going after this city or recovering uh, if that was the case. Okay, there we go. So, let's go Military Academy. That sounds fine. And uh, now I'll go... There we go. Finish this trader. Perfect. That's a good idea. And I don't think we're going to be able to get this, this guy to the front lines just yet, but I need to... Can't, I wish I could... I don't know why it shows me that I can hit that guy, but I can't. Uh, okay. So let's do some damage. He's only at 50 defense. So my bombards... Yeah, my bombards are going to be really, really effective. Uh, boom. I'd like to use... Take the city with this guy. Let's go wing to Zara attack. And then you walk in. Okay, perfect. Okay, now you guys heal. We gotta be careful of this knight. We don't really, I mean, don't need to worry about it too much, but let's get in there. Okay, cool. Do I want to press forward? I kind of do with this knight just to see what's going on. Alright, good. Yeah, so his capital is somewhere right here. It shouldn't have too big of an impact. And let's send you across. And I'll send the battering ram with us too. Just in case. Okay. Yeah. More internal trade routes. Best thing. Best thing for us. Boom. I'm a fort. That's right. This took... Oh, I can't... I can only build one fort. Oh, dang. I forgot about that. Well, what am I going to do with this? Um, I don't even know what I'm going to do with you now. Just go and sleep. I don't think I cost... Civilian units don't cost maintenance. I think military engineers count as civilian units. Okay. They're coming after us. Oh, I bet you that they're coming after us. Yep, 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 yep. I bet, I bet they don't do that. They haven't done that in two videos. And I'm not sure if it's because I brought my own. No, that can't be it. My own military engineer, that couldn't be it. Okay, well, we just need to play more carefully. Ooh, okay, let's take this guy. Um, back you up inside the city. We have, we built another boat. Wow, that's crazy. Okay, this is good. I'll, I'll do one frigate. I'll upgrade one of my boats to a frigate. That way this city is a little bit more safe. Even though they don't even attack the city. They attack the capital. Uh, I'm going to anticipate it. I'm going to pull another crossbowman over this way now. I think Peter's coming after me, man. I think it's going to happen. I don't even know if we need this musket, man. I'm going to pull him up here, too. Yeah, I'm, I'm paranoid. I'm paranoid. Last time Peter like started lining the borders up, he, he declared war. So... Dang, have two forts in your empire. I was going to do that. Field cannons are pretty important in this situation. Oh, man, I would like a factory, too, though. All right, I'll do that for extra production. Okay. Um, yeah, bank. Oh, wait a second. Don't I still need another trade route? Oh, no. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, then go with the bank. Let's repair the encampment. Sounds good. And uh, I'm going to back you up. Yeah, we're going to back you up. Uh, well, you just took that spot from me. Okay, so Bombards won't be able to defend very well either way. So I might as well send them forward. Uh, that's Hills. Oh, man, we're going to need to get right there. This is not going to be an easy city to take. 
Yeah, this will not be an easy city to take at all. Um, let's send this other musket man back north. Okay, siege tower. You sit there and heal. Okay, the city's only at 48 defense, though. This is the time to hit. This is the time to start striking against it. We probably only need two bombards, just like we only used two bombards against that encampment. So I think that will still work for the most part. No, get the food. There you go. Get the food, Drew. Um, let's make sure the capital has some good stuff. Ah, we are stuck. Kind of stuck. Yeah, Norway cannot be doing that well. They were doing well. I don't know what they're doing now. They didn't take up any German cities. Okay, so what do I count? Two Cossacks? I'll be ready for them if they come after me. Okay, so let's move you in this encampment real swift. You inside the capital. There we go. And uh, we did get... What did we get? Okay, let's just get this. What is this? Holy Sight Adjacency Bonus? We really have stayed away. Maybe we don't need this. Look, we boosted this. Uh, production towards... Builders. Renaissance. Gold. Original. Okay, maybe that instead. Colonialism. Since we've boosted it, it won't take too long. Let's repair this. Man, that sucks. They totally pillaged the crap out of that area. Okay, water mill. And uh, we lost, I think, one of my... The build... Oh, there we go. Plus four gold. Perfect. Even better for fixing the economy. Alright, there we go. Okay, I didn't realize I was losing that much gold. Holy crap. Would he really, though? Would Russia really... Yeah, he's got a bigger military. Oh, yeah, so he for sure will. Yeah, he would because uh, he's got a bigger military than you, Drew. So, definitely need to think about that. Let's... Do I have another... Okay, I've got one here. Let's back you up, sir. Oh, it's still not, still not the next... Oh, there we go. Wait, why can't I move that guy? Well, I don't know. Either way, they're coming. Wait, maybe I should move you inside the encampment. Well, it doesn't matter. And uh, this guy's good to go. I wouldn't mind going around, but I don't think we can. Promotion, extra sight. I like it. Going around might be the best scenario. Okay, I'm going to send the knight first. Even though he might be in trouble. It said it because he's less important. No offense, Mr. Knight. I can send this winged czar after him. But that way I get some melee unit over here at some point. Let's let's do a good route. I think we should go to the capital and maybe get an international route up. I'd like to start making gold again. It's kind of weird that we're not making gold. <laughs> I don't know if I've got a few peace deals that are giving me gold. I feel like I do. A few peace deals that are beneficial to me. Oh my gosh, 775 gold per turn. Holy crap. Okay, so maybe... If you give me Cornith or whatever. Give me this one. No. How about without this and without this? Without this? Without this. No. Okay. Not good. That's a great deal. That's a lot of gold. But I think I purely need power right now. And power comes from cities. And the gold's not going to help me. Gold's not going to help me win this campaign. But where's War Wariness at in my capital? Okay, it's still at zero. So we're fine. Yeah, we're fine. Let's get a builder. Because we still haven't gotten one of those out yet. Um, Dang. You did hit me. Okay, what I'll do... We'll destroy this guy. I'll move this guy in place. So that's woods. I'll just move him there. Bam. Bam. And then uh, siege tower comes here. And then there goes my Wing Tazars after him. Let's... You go sleep. You go to sleep. Now, I think I wanted... Yeah, I wanted gold, but do I have, like, a lot of gold? Like, you know, maybe I won't. Maybe I will just go after the food in production. Because 10 gold per turn, I don't know if it's worth it. When I can actually help out a city a lot. Okay, so you're good. 
Those Cossacks are pretty powerful. They're Cossack core units, so they're pretty powerful. I don't want to forget my my famous time with the Cossacks, where I realized, oh shit, the Cossacks are really powerful. <laughs> that was pretty crazy. All right, you just sleep there forever. I don't really care. This, this, where am I going to colonize? Besides America. I would love to see what it looks like, though. I really want to see if the AI did it. The UK or, or I'm sorry, Britain. It's Britain or England? England. Um, yeah, we'll see. Okay, so I'll move... Yeah, I don't think Rome... I don't think anyone in Europe wants to mess with me at this point, because I'm too high on the scale. Samaria, maybe. Yeah, most people in Europe are not doing that well. Oh, well, you know, Spain is pretty good. France is at 300. Rome's at 300. Yeah, they're not going to mess. All right, cool. So I can pretty much have my way with Europe, it seems like, after this war with Greece, if I wanted to. Um... Okay, let's start doing this. Big hit there. So you're dead, basically. Nice. Okay, so I can go after some trade routes now. I will pull this guy over, and uh, we're good to go. So this city's going to be ours either way. And maybe I can still get that peace deal out of Rome, or out of Greece. That amazing, like, 700 gold that they have. Where did they get all that gold from? That's where I want to know. Okay. Yeah, no, I think we're done with... I don't... I've had too many trade routes. We sent most of my trade routes back to my capital. The problem is, I don't know if I trust Russia. I really don't know if I trust Russia enough to give them gold. Yeah, this is a good deal. Silk for just my extra three-nighter. Whoa, Japan's doing amazing. They got a ton of cities. What the hell? Japan Japan does not do that well, usually. Was China destroyed? I think that's what happened. China was killed early on. That's pretty shocking. That's another good deal. Uh, I've got extra sources at Niter. Yeah, yeah, I guess so. More amenities is, is best, because I want to stay at war. War wariness. I want to make sure I don't... I don't know if we're... So, wait a second. Are we even... We're getting war wariness, I believe. Uh, no, I don't think we are, actually, because it's a defensive war. That makes sense. I was wondering if that was the case. Yeah, I think that's the case. Anyways. And, uh... Let's have you take it. Oh, I don't know if you can. We'll probably have to hit it one more time. Okay, now you can take it. Okay, and then we move in. Oh, we also got the, uh, what is this, the Great Lighthouse? That's cool. Yeah, that's pretty nice. Okay, and then I will take you on. Oh, I didn't, oh, that's right, we pushed him back. Forgot about that. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna keep this city for sure. There we go. Okay, so now we're looking a lot better. I'm really liking this. Now. Um, I don't want you to go fully forward, because I think my winged Azar could die here. Man, 12 golds and 4 production. Alright, you know what? I'm going to take that. I might regret it. But it's only one route out of 10 or so. I don't like this guy sitting here. What? <laughs> no, what the hell? Get out of here. Get out of here, Gandhi. What is... Alright, alright. What, what's up with everyone being a jerk today? Is that just a common thing? Is it jerk day? Is 1555 AD jerk day? I'm going to find out what happened that year. And, and probably end up figuring out some some shit that went down. All right, so you're... Yeah, that's a pretty good deal. Uh, I'm going to refuse it because I want to see what else I can do. I did lose my Winged Tazar, but it's still worth it. See, I don't... You know what? I'm really... I really don't like Winged Tazars at all. I pushed that guy back. I moved into range of Athens, and then and then he killed me. I'm not a fan of Winged Tazars. I'll be completely honest. Don't like them at all. Because I don't like they're, that they're a part of the civics. A lot of unique units don't have an upgrade path. When they do, it's re they're really powerful. Like when you can build like a swordsman and then upgrade to a melee unit, uh, to your unique melee unit or whatever it is down the tech tree, that's really powerful. So it's kind of normal that they you can't do that for Poland. I, I don't know. I, I hate them. I like the way they look, though. I think they look cool, but 
really not a fan right now. Um, again, unless you're playing a culture game and then I guess you rush it, but I don't know. Yep, not, not a fan. Okay, so let's heal. And, oh, I got a builder out of this. We actually needed one of these. Is there anything I need to repair? I'm sure there is. Yeah, I need to repair this, it looks like. Are we at war, Gandhi? Can they get out of here with their missionary craps? <laughs> All right. Athens will not be easy to take, Drew. That's something I need to keep in mind. Oh, yeah, I kind of will. One, two, three. Bombards. It won't be that bad. I'm going to keep pressing forward. I'm going to keep pressing forward. I won't kill Greece, but... I'll come close. All right. I actually didn't need that lumber mill there, but whatever. I've got another builder coming. At this point, no one, no one in Europe can really do anything unless you have Russia's help, which I'm, I'm well defended. I'm, I don't want to say well defended, but I'm able to defend myself from Russia. I feel like with these two cities, and you can't go past because I've got a mountain range here, which is. Actually, pretty good. Boom. So I'm going to slap this down. Maybe I can get another one. That's a Caravel, Drew. There you go. Bam. So we've got three frigates that can, you know, provide a lot of support there. So that city's pretty much safe. I hate this. We need to move this guy. Probably just there. Because they would need to attack from the south up. Because the encampment's going to make it too difficult for them to come after me. Trader in two turns. I like it. And let's just focus on this here. Do I want to take this guy down? Kind of. Oh, that encampment is going to be kind of a problem. Let's get you over here. Oh, nice. Look at that range on these cavalry units. That's beautiful. Alright, bam. You come in. You come in. And then there we go. Nice. Okay, and then maybe I'll bring the knight maybe for extra support. We might need him. Their boats are going to be really annoying. Uh, Alright, and we don't need this guy here. You know what? I'm going to send... I feel like I'm a little bit worried about Lubland. Lubland, such a strange name. For me, I feel very, very strange saying that sometimes because I don't think I'm pronouncing it right. I think someone told me that it's not... Technically, Lublin, it's something else. And it was even more complicated. <laughs> uh, but anyways, okay, what, what else is new? Gandhi's denouncing me. But I don't know if this is the correct name. I thought it was something, I thought someone said it was something else. Like there's a much longer, more complicated name, which would explain my confusion pronouncing it. Um, okay, so we're going to try to take Athens. I might peace out, I might not, I don't know. I love how Spain does that. It just screams at me. Um... I'm going to try to take Athens, leave them with Argos, even though I should burn down Argos, or try to take it in a peace deal. That way I can burn it down. What are we going to do then, though? I don't need access to the Mediterranean. Anyways, I'm going to stop right there. Uh, Polish Empire has been growing quite a bit, which is nice. Maybe I'll go after Germany. I have to really think. We're going to figure out what we want to do. And obviously, we're not going to end this campaign without going to war with Russia. Um, I just don't know if we're entirely ready for that, and I don't really see a reason to go to war with Russia just yet. They're a big threat. And uh, I, I don't know if my borders are completely secure. I don't want to go to war with Russia and then someone, a neighbor, comes after me. Even though my neighbors are not very weak anymore, or, or not very powerful anymore. Um, I, I, I don't know. I think we need to wait for the modern era, information era, maybe some nukes before we go after Peter. But anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.